Okay, we are going to expand this log, log base 5 of 125 over y to the second power, z to the seventh power. And let's count how many things do we have. On the top, we have just 125, so that's one thing, right? On the bottom, we have y to the second power times z to the seventh power, so we have two things. All together, we will have three things. When we expand it, we are going to get 3 log base 5. And let me show you how this is going to be done. So first, I will write this down as this is equal to log base 5, and then I'll put this down, 125. And you see that this is positive because 125 is on the numerator. But then if you see that the y to the second power, that's multiplying with z to the seventh power, and then they are both in the denominator, we are going to be doing subtraction. So remember, division means we subtract. We are going to subtract the second log base 5, but then I'll put down the y to the second power right here, like this. And I'll also break down uh, the product in the denominator as subtraction, subtraction. So we are going to get a minus. Even though right here this is multiplying, but then once again, because z to the seventh power is in the denominator, so we just keep subtracting, okay? Anyways, we will have log base 5, and then we put down z to the 7th power. So this is the first step, and now we just have to take care of each every part. So for the first one, log base 5 of 125, we see that 125 is the same as 5 to the 3rd power, so we can write this down as log base 5, and then the 125 will put this down as 5 to the 3rd power, and as we can see, log base 5 and the 5 to the 3rd power they have the same base, so you can reduce them, right? They cancel each other out. And that means I just have number 3 for the first part. Namely, log base 5 of 125 is just a regular number 3. And then how about what can we do for these two things? Well, we see that y to the second power, we have the power right here, right? But then this is log base 5, this is base y to the second power, we cannot cancel them out. But then what we can do is we can take the power and then bring that to the front. Likewise, we can do the same right here, log base 5 of z to the 7th power, we can take the 7 and then bring that to the front. So we are going to have minus, the 2 is now in the front, and then we will have the log base 5 of y, and then minus, the 7 will be in the front, and then we will have the log base 5, of z like this and this is the most that we can do that's it